got to be ready to drop by now. Don't overdo it. I won't. I know my limits, unlike some people. Oh, oh. now who's the tough guy? What is going on? Also, hello everyone, and welcome back to Chronos Plays Final Fantasy 13. What was that? A Grand Pulse Falci. Used to see it flying around all the time. And they said it had a home, somewhere near Erba. So that's good news, right? If we stay on its tail, we should end up in your village. Let's follow it. No! Right. Uh... So I was walking back to the, uh, the sea stone. That, uh... That we saw, like, a couple episodes ago. And I, I, that cutscene just started. Th I think I hopefully I hit the record button at the... Well, quick enough, and it, it got everything. But... Yeah, no, that's... Guess I should have been recording from the start of this. Uh, because... I, I literally thought I was just going to be backtracking all the way there. Not that cutscenes would start... Or be placed in places that we've already been. It's kind of interesting that that happened. I don't know. Maybe it's dynamic. Not dynamic, but like maybe like they kind of expected people to be wandering around. And they're like, okay, here's multiple places where the same cutscenes could happen. And I just triggered them, I guess. I don't know. Or maybe it's like we figured people would get lost and come down here. Yeah, I don't know. We'll be back someday. Well, there's another destination marker in my way. So... Alright. That was just transitioning from areas, right? But I'm not going to that just yet. So remember this for later, okay? Okay. Because I'll probably be back here. If we have to come back here for this, for whatever reason, I'll come back here for that. Um, I'll do it off screen, though. Like I was saying before, we're going to go to that sea stone and do that mission from two episodes ago. And we're back to the step, or whatever this place is called. Didn't take too long, I guess. Uh, probably like 20 minutes without the combat. Eh, maybe. Probably last time, actually. Like, my, I've been recording for 10 minutes, and I think I was only walking for a few minutes before that cutscene actually started playing. Um, I didn't get into too many battles. I have enough for level up, but we'll just save that for later. I probably should definitely save. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So, the quest marker is now pointing here, which... Maybe that alternate path actually just leads to this area, which is fine. Um, but yeah, anyways, let's examine the Seath Stone. Because we saw a bunch of these on the way. Um, we just couldn't do anything to it. Pawn Scum. The gelatinous rube beside the pawn is a very electro, is the very electro pudding I seek. I need only slay it to avoid becoming a Seath. How many years must it have been since I left the village in pursuit of that vile be uh, pest? My brand will not wait forever. I must kill it and quick. And then when I awaken from my crystal slumber, I can help repair the ruin it left in its uh, in its wake. Sure. Mission commenced. And that marks it on my map. There. All right. Doesn't appear on my mini map. So hopefully I and keep going the right way. I know there's new enemies over there, but let's go get our mark first. It's right there near a save point. A lot of new... Oh, treasure. Hey, it's one of those things that giant dude ate. Yeah, there's the save point. There is... Some things from Dot Hack that you uh, feel, uh, feed the Grunties, right? Actually, they kind of look like Grunties. They're adorable! 
How do I get over there? Here? Is that a no? I can't... I can't go over there just yet? Really? Alright, then why even mark it? Is that the pudding that I would need to fight? Uh, I think so. See if we can get a... I was gonna say a sneak attack on it. Oh my god, your eyes! Alright, so... I guess Lieber it first. Should I consider this a boss encounter? I don't... I don't know. I think we'll actually be able to get it staggered without a commando. Yeah, our... well... I say that, but I'm probably gonna have to heal. Let's heal. He can shoot it. Slow down its, uh... Attack, and then we'll go back to Try Disaster. And go to town on it. 700, huh? Oh, that damage output there. I'm beautiful. I guess I really should have put, like, the Nail and Hope in my party, because they're the magic users of the group. I mean, we're all magic users of the group, but they have the higher magic stats, and not to mention the accessories for it. Easy. Easy peasy cover, girl. Oh, I should buy that thing. Energy Sash. Uh, your party has earned the rank Good Samaritan. Is that the same Seath Stone that just appeared here? Uh, energy Sash. Do I not need to go back and turn this in? Uh, TP charge restores a small amount of TP each time an enemy is defeated. I guess that's good. So this is grand uh, let's see. Time runs short. Today is the day I put an end to that troublesome... Uri Dimu? The problem, I fear, will be the pack of loyal whatever those monsters are called. The master alone is worthy is a worthy foe enough. Must I face the hounds as well? Alas, if it must be so, so be it. Sure? Do we not need to go back to that old Seath Stone? Where is the mark? I wish they would just appear on the map. Maybe oh, it's up there. I put like a west marker <laughs> up there. Okay, we just travel north. That seems doable. I see a treasure over there. We should go get that. And I see a sea stone. Though of course the sea stone is on the ground, so that means what? We can't actually do anything with it. Excuse me, dog. One of these days, we'll learn how to use these glowing things on the ground. I hope. Because it, it, it calls out to me. I guess we're just going to come up here and fight you guys, huh? Oh, well, that's shocking and worrying. Apparently, these guys can summon uh, behemoths. I did not know that. That's fine. I guess we didn't kill him fast enough. I was trying to kill these guys fast enough. I think Saz is gonna die. No, Snow is gonna die, huh? We just need to kill some of these dudes before... Like, we can revive. But I'm gonna go ahead and do Solidarity again. No, oh, we saved him. We gotta win this. No kidding! Of course we gotta win this! This treasure! I guess we go relentless. Well, on this guy, it's not that good because he's resisting the magic. At the same time, oh, Snow's dead. Great. Well. Yeah, you do this. You ravage it up a little bit. Steady now. We gotta win this. Don't attack Saz. What did I just say? I'm 
I'm hoping the stagger gauge is being filled still. It's still being full, sure. We'll worry about his uh, health in a little bit. In a little bit. I mostly just want to get this guy... Uh, stagger, then I'm going to launch his ass in the air with triple Cerberus. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. He doesn't seem to like attacking that much, which I'm fine with. Yeah, what are you doing? The dude's just, like, going for a stroll. Where's Snow? Oh, he's... Right beside you. Also, you missed. That's kind of hilarious, actually. Yeah, like, he couldn't find Snow to his side. Relentless probably would have been... Relentless Assault, I should say, should probably would have been a alright choice there to... to get the, uh, the damage multiplier going higher. Yeah. Oh, we just don't want this guy to transform. To say the least. If he transforms, that ba that's bad, okay? Because they hurt when they're transformed. They also recover their full health, so we need to kill him, like, now. Please attack him. Thank you. He's not experience. Makes sense. Just fought a crap ton of enemies. Took like four minutes to. A Zephyr Cape. Was it Zephyr Ring? Just resist win. Alright, well, I mean, that makes sense. Uh, where's my mark? Mark is up there. Sea stone there and sea stone there. Do I have to, like, do all the Seath missions to unlock the Seath stones? Oh, you found me. I don't want to do that. Um, I hope that's not the case. Hopefully these things just unlock themselves or... I get the ability to unlock them in the future. Because I'd rather just, I don't know, do it that way. We do need the heal. We're getting low on health. Time for another approach. Stay okay, apparently I should have stayed in the healer form for a little while longer. Because he's dead. Of course he is. He's snow. It's so what he does, even though he's the tank and not supposed to. That was kind of a joke. He actually doesn't die that much. Wow. He dies a lot. For my taste. But that's mostly because I'm not really usually healing. And who knows what other better accessories I could be using on these enemies, or on these characters. He is poisoned. This boss man? I could have buffed as well, couldn't I have? You should be dead. You're not dead. I guess I should have just let that attack gauge fill up. Alright, let's come down here real fast. Everyone gets healed up and cured. Did I Libra you? I mean, I don't think we need to. Gonna get staggered this time around, maybe. Maybe? He might also just be dead. Yeah, he's just dead. Just 
See you, Daddy, now. Uh... What? Uh, oval tight, tight, oval tight. And that one. Unlocked. Is that how this is going to go? Alright, weren't we just there? I'm not going back there. Right, because like... Oh, we can't go that way. Oh, maybe that's what that symbol was. It wasn't the quest symbol. I don't know. Maybe I'm just dumb. Yeah, we were just... There, weren't we? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Go back there for a second. Oh, you put my my rankings there, huh? Yeah, let's uh head towards the marker. Cause yeah, wasn't that the other area? I wish I could see the other areas. Like maybe uh, data log locations. Yeah, I was there. Yeah, that's where I just was. Where I got the uh, the quests. Not quests, but the cutscenes that just appeared out of nowhere. I think that's a save point or a quest marker ahead. It could also be lights. Saz, hurry up, dog. Oh, it could just be nothing, actually. What do you mean, what would you even do with this space? I don't know, camp? Enjoy it? Just sit here and have a picnic? It's very pretty. Reminds me of the calm lands. How close are we? We're not close. <laughs> We're not close at all. So do the messages just unlock, like, one after the other? That seems weird. <laughs> I... I don't think that's gonna be how it is. That can't be how it is, right? There's a treasure there. That thing looks like he's gonna wanna fight. Preemptive? No, not even close. Alright, what are you? Okay. I mean, I gotta just Libra your ass. Did you just do a thousand points of damage to me? Oh. Alright. I mean, a thousand points of damage to me is pretty bad. Yeah, we're dead. Okay. So. No. That did not work out well. I'm gonna come back later. <laughs> because we can't take that amount of damage from a single attack. So we'll uh, we'll worry about that chest later. I mean, maybe if I started as a sentinel with a medic. No, because he, he did he attacked us too fast for that to really matter. Like, we would need two healers. We'd probably need three healers, to be quite honest. Um, we're just gonna avoid all these guys. Apparently, they're gonna want to fight either way. Two behemoths? Oh. Well... There's a chest here, isn't there? I thought I just saw a chest. Is there? Oh, it's right behind him. I mean... 
Do I chance it? I say we chance it. And we just run right by them. And they're none the wiser. None the wiser. All right. So, same plans as the other behemoths, pretty much, is you focus on one, stagger it. Behemoth Kings. Oh, we're not gonna win this. <laughs> we're not gonna win this at all. Hey, can you challenge better? Good job. Dog. You're not... You're not doing it. You're not... You're failing as a tank. Oh, you got one. Now, I think... Therefore, I am. But I also think, like, we probably are not gonna... get this. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, yeah. You know what? Pearl me. Thank you. May I have another? No. We need more health. And or resistance to physical damage. And or the float spell. So we can just fly over these enemies. Okay, so one on one we can take those guys. Two, two's a little much. I feel like I'm failing a lot this episode. Who is back here? Sat, no, S Snow, what are you doing? You're very foggy out recently. Is that the guy that was blocking the chest? No. We're going to avoid him, because him and his counterparts seem to just want to kill people. By kill people, I mean, like, stomp and cause a massive amount of damage. Is this the right way we're going? Or there's a save point up ahead. Yeah, one behemoth is fine. Two behemoth, not so much. And we will level up. We get, like... Ooh, nice, thank you. We got, like, 12,000... We might have more than 12,000 at this point. No, we have 12,000, exactly. Alright, let's go ahead and level up our Crystarium a little bit. Go Commando, get another good chunk of health. Get even more health. Get some magic. And then work on the Spellga. Which, I'm assuming, seeing how we get it, it's a technique. Alright. So I guess we can use that on enemies when... Uh, they buff themselves, and I'm the leader. Seems fair to me. You were synergist, right? Is that right? You got these down here? Yeah. You can tell just if they're glowing or not, but... I'm just bad at that. Good amount of stuff there. Bang, you're doing commando. Good job. Get some magic, even though I'm probably never going to have you use it. You are doing... Saboteur? Saboteur. Get that strength that we're not using with you. And this magic, though, on the other hand, is fantastic. Oh, we're going to get Impel Imperilga. And I'm going to just love every second of that. Uh, hope you're Synergist, right? Low amount of HP for the cost. And strength and magic. Yeah, you and Vanille are the magic users. And you guys will pretty much rock when it comes to, like, just magic damage. Your ATB gauge is coming. That's good. Definitely going to finish this one off. I, don't, I guess we'll go for the accessory slot after this. Right? Though Ravager will probably be better in terms of abilities and... Just damage output. 
All right, where are we going? Going up. Now it looks like two guys are having a, a bit of a a bit of a tussle down here. But let's see who we want to kill. I'm gonna go with the Behemoth King. And there. Oh, you know what? No, Cerberus. Quickly, launch him in the air, please. Oh, wait, the dude is... No! No, don't heal! Please don't heal! I should have launched him from the start of this. Artemis from the start of this? No. Launching from the start of this. I am so sad. At the very least, the big other big dude is attacking the beam. Oh, they're attacking each other, so that's fantastic. Um, I thought that wasn't going to happen anymore, but whatever. That's fine. I'm happy that they are attacking each other. I'd rather them just attack each other than me. Especially the behemoth. Oh, no. Ow! You dick! You unbelievable dick! Try- yeah, Relentless Assault. Yeah, fight that guy, dude. He's a threat. I'm not. I don't know where you got that idea from. Feel free to kill him, though. No, don't blitz. Do not ballroom- Why did I- Why would you blitz? We don't want to fight the other one at the same time, please. How we doing? You got a lot of health. Saz! How you doing, dog? Yeah, we should probably just definitely, like, do that, yeah. Heal up just a tad. Hopefully he's poisoned now. He says he's not poisoned. Man, I should have definitely... Definitely... Launched this dude at the beginning of the battle. There was no reason for me not to. I should have, as soon as we staggered him, switched over to launch. Instead, I just was like, oh, let's build up his damage multiplier. And do not sunder. You missed, thankfully. I could buff up. But at the same time, I don't want to lose the stagger. Not even that, I just... I don't know. I just have this. I don't know how I feel about that. Maybe I should redo my uh, paradigms a little bit. New strategy. This is taking a while, you're right. Well, seeing how we need to heal anyways. Uh, he's dead. Seems about right. Good thing we're getting that buffing in. Steady now. At the very least, yeah, I was gonna say haste up lightning, and then we can go back to relentless assault. Thankfully, we didn't lose a stagger. And we'll go back to protection. You haste up snow. Then we go to try disaster. Are we alive? We're back to protection. And never mind, we're dead. Hmm. That could have went a lot better if at the start of the battle we actually launched his ass. But 
seeing how they're so kind, we're just gonna walk the other way. Kronos, you really need to do some of these missions and level up a little bit. I, I know. There's a way through here. Yeah? Thanks, Captain Obvious. Why were we all the way back there? Does this lead to the area that we were at last time? I kind of hope it does, to be quite honest. One, we have a mission there. Two, it's just, it would make sense to me, given that there were cutscenes and everything down there. And I hadn't had any indication that we needed to go that way. I'm going to say no. This is not the way. This is a maw of the abyss. I don't like this one bit. Right. Good comeback, Saz. All right. Well, um we're in the maw of the abyss, which is a lovely name for a vacation spot. Uh, and that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, when you head to my videos, so check out some of the content and see if it's to your liking. If you're interested in watching me live stream, head on over to twitch.tv slash Give my channel a follow to be notified when I go live. Either way, thank you for watching. Hope you all have a great day.